Hi guys, welcome to part 14 of my challenge to uh, beat the 1984 campaign on cold waters with a skipjack submarine. Thank you for watching and uh, let's crack on shall we? Okay, so this is not a good start then because uh, I'm picking up exactly from where I finished off last time and uh, getting to port seems to be a bit of an issue at the moment. Anyway, oh, here we are finally. So check my orders. So I'm going to be after a carrier task force on this mission. So we are and uh, repair the damaged tube from the last mission when I blew it up accidentally. We're launching a decoy a bit too fast. Okay, so that's me all loaded up. Let's uh, let's head out and see if we can find this enemy carrier group. Ah, another little news report. So Denmark has been conquered. But there's still plenty more blues than reds on the map there, so I'm happy with that. I'm guessing that ship there is uh -huh, is my contact. So yeah, hopefully that's the carrier task force. We'll wait to find out. Just going to load up a couple of decoys there because uh, these enemy surface Star troops can be quite contact. dangerous. Last bearing zero four six contact faded. Rig ship for ultra quiet. Make turns Make turns for okay, well the ocean's two. nice and deep here. That's good. I do like to be able to fight in deep water if possible. Okay, no signs of visual. I might need to raise my depth an extra five feet to periscope depth of 45 instead of trying to see stuff at 50 feet. Make depth four, five, eight, ah, there you go, there's a visual contact. Con maneuvering, Con maneuvering, making turns for. Okay, must two, be some range out because it's quite hard to make it out on the. Uh, the waterfall there, the broadband waterfall solar panel, uh, what it is. Nope, that's not a carrier by the looks of it. Having trouble identifying this one. Can't get a decent enough uh, sonar return. Mind you, with the state of the, the, state of the sea state, it's not really surprising um, because the background noise is, is quite high. Therefore, it is affecting my ability to get a decent detection of that vessel and what it is. Sonar Master One is classified as escort. Yeah, I'm going across to two on that. I think that's about the uh, the best classification I can I can I can gather. So it probably is across the two to be fair, but with the detection um, ability so poor, it is hard to make it out. But that's what I'm going to go with. Uh, this one's better. Uh, but I can make that out a lot easier. Okay, well there's only two vessels at the moment, so where's the rest of this uh, carrier task force? So a Cresta and a Kawa, by the looks of it. Okay, 
Let's have a look at the night vision. So we find there's anything else around. Oh, it's definitely two vessels, but it's looking like maybe that is it. So maybe this is not the carrier task force at all. Not to the wrong key on my keyboard there. Um, for that doesn't quite close though. He's not travelling very fast. That'd be the Kawa. Okay. Nope. So it looks like I've just got a two-ship uh, surface action group here instead of uh, instead of a carrier task force, which is a bit of a shame. <clears throat> just having a quick scout around, just in case there's anything else. I mean, this was the general vicinity, according to the instructions where the task force should be. So, um, no, it does appear just to be these two ships only. That's kind of annoying, but anyway, not to worry. I normally radar raise mask. radar mask because it's like uh, it's like the equivalent of going active sonar with your sonar array. So, um, but just in case, Lower the radar mask. nothing got picked up by the radar mask. No, nothing, nothing additional anyway. So, oh well, here's where it is. Let's see go for it. A fight is a fight, so let's have it. Con sonar regained contact on master two bearing zero three nine. Con fire control weapon acquired. Con fire control weapon acquired. Nice to see state is probably having me out quite a bit as well. So it'll be uh, making myself harder to detect. To detect. <clears throat> Just fired a torpedo at me, uh, well, at the bearing more than anything else. Probably doesn't know exactly where it is. Shoot two six. Go on, go I sir. Yeah. Con sonar lost contact. Master two. Last bearing zero three. Okay, well that was six. nice and easy. Contact so breaking let's, 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 let's. Okay, this torpedo here is probably going to find me soon. Come left two three two. One. Make turns for one zero knots. Maneuvering eye. I'm hoping 10 knots should be enough to get out of the way that uh, torpedo before it goes active, but uh, Con, let's see, I've got my depth of it as well. Feet. Passing 400 feet. 400. Passing 500 feet. Con, torpedo room. Passing 600 feet. It's a bit of time for pressing out to speak otherwise it'd be here all day. <clears throat> passing 700 feet. Passing 700 feet. Passing 800 feet. Make depth four by feet dive by. Con torpedo room tube six ready. Do I try to post scope depth again just to get a better range on the targets or the remaining target, the uh, Cresta. Upscope. So I can find it and laser it. Down to That's good. Ah, oh, there it is. Right, okay. Lower the radar mast. Shoot two one. Shoot two one. Sure I that should be him going down shortly, hopefully. Make turns for two knots. Maneuvering eye. Passing 200 
I've not managed. Uh, I've not needed to set off my decoys yet, which is good. Passing 300 so I've still got feet. Those and my tubes ready. Passing 400 feet. Passing 500 feet. Passing 600 feet. Okay, Passing target acquired. 700 feet. Again, a bit of time compression to speed things up. Okay, so he's automatically fired a, a torpedo to counter. It's probably going to be nowhere near me. I just aimed at the bearing and just gone, let one go. Con sonar regained contact on Master. And you're one, in here somewhere? Bearing. Oh, he's already Three, gone. There two, you go. One. So, both surface combatants down. Okay, very easy mission. Not the mission I was after, but very easy. Let's keep looking around here. Hopefully, these, uh, this carry task force will show up. Yeah, that's still my orders. So, where is this task force? You know, submarines uh, in the area, but where's the task force? Or was the carrier group, I should say? Sometimes to do it further, I've known a a submarine icon uh, be detection of a submarine, but also include an enemy surface group as well. So give that a go. On sonar, new contact bearing one nine six designated Sierra one. Rig ship for ultra quiet. Make turns one two. Make turns four two knots. Maneuvering eye. Con sonar launch transient from Sierra One. Con sonar switching to active, Con sonar, switching to active search. Get range on him. Con fire control, we've lost the wire. Con sonar, we are right, cavitating. Solution. Passing 100 feet. Oh, there's another one there as well. Con okay. sonar switching to passive search. Come left to so There's at least two one, enemies here. Zero. Helm I. Passing 300 feet. Make depth one zero 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 feet. Dive by. Con sonar no longer cavitating. Con helm steady court come right to one seven zero helm I. Yeah, he's trying to come around on the approximate sort of bearing of where that second one is. Con helm. I hope the, uh, my first torpedo will find the first target on its own, so that should be good. Oh my damn. The only trouble is though, I can't actually see where my enemies are, which is a bit of a shame. I'm sure if I had a more modern sub like a Los Angeles class, I'd probably have them all <laughs> all in range, detected and uh, you know, solutioned up and everything as well. Plus, with an LA class slab submarine, you can... Um, Rig ship for wire guide quiet. four torpedoes at the same time as well, so uh, and like the skipjack, which unfortunately you can only wire guide one simultaneously. Con sonar, noise maker bearing two zero eight. Con dive at one zero zero zero. Well, to be fair, the more I'm playing with the skipjack, the more I'm enjoying it as well. Contact um, on Sierra one bearing two because one, like, it is the zero. earliest boat, it is the loudest. It is pretty much the least capable, apart from having six tubes to the other boats uh, four. It is more of a challenge, and I do like a challenge when I'm playing the game, so, uh, yeah. Con sonar, Sierra 1, is classified as so that, submerged submarine. Uh -huh. Con maneuvering, making turns for five. If that's the correct classification, nine. that would explain why I'm having trouble detecting what the enemy is, because kilos are very, very quiet boats. And even today in the world, they are a serious threat. Uh, even to nuclear submarines. Uh, they, they can just 
you know, lay in wait outside Contact. outside harbour somewhere. Uh, or, or, you know, out of, outside an area they want to protect. Shut down and just listen. Shoot two four, I sir. Shoot two four, I sir. A nuclear boat can never be completely silent. Because you can't just shut down a nuclear reactor. Yep, so that's definitely key though. Con sonar, noise maker, bearing, oh, two, noise, one, noise nine. Maker. Dropped his countermeasure, but that's fine. I'm wire guided, he's got no chance. Okay, gotta go around the houses here to get to him, but hey, not to worry. Con sonar, noise maker bearing two, two, six. Switching the second? passive search. Ah, there he is. Con sonar new contact bearing one five three Kilo designated Denied. Sierra okay. two. Con sonar Sierra two is classified as submerged submarine. It's not often to get two kilos together. You might get one kilo and one older boat, but um, two kilos? No one. So you'll appear somewhere. Gotta be here anytime soon. That's trouble though when you've got such a poor solution on the target. You can Con either be sonar, a lot further than you think search. it is or a lot closer. You really don't know. Oh there he is. Con sonar, switching the passive search. Con sonar, switching He's winning. He's off. He doesn't want to know. Sonar, noise maker bearing one, four, seven. Con, fire control, weapon <laughs> countermeasure. Oh, well, he only. drops a countermeasure. But he can't avoid a wire guided torpedo. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. And despite playing the 84 campaign with uh, the skipjack, you know, the Mark 48s are probably the best torpedo uh, in the US campaign Con, at this stage control, in the game. Weapon anyway, acquired. So, um, Con sonar, noise maker, the bearing, 48 one, actually better than four, seven. most of the other torpedoes in the game. So, you know. Con, There's only a couple control, of uh, enemies acquired. that have comparable torpedoes to the Mark 48. And this is not one of them. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. Steer him as target, come on. Goodbye. Con sonar, <laughs> noise maker, bearing one, four, five. Oh, Con, torpedo room, ready. 
Right, okay, still got enemy weapons nearby. Okay, so clearly that wasn't what I was looking for, but uh, where is this carrier group? Is that it over there? I mean, if I hang around this area, it's supposed to be coming towards me, so let's see what happens, shall we? Okay, there we go, that could be it. There's a submarine there, though. I uh, don't want that. Try to avoid the submarine because I don't want to miss the carrier group. Nice big juicy target. Come on, where are you? Right, that uh, carry group should be here anytime soon. I mean, here I am looking around for it. Unless potentially this is one of um, Cold Water's annoying little bugs. Sometimes the game does do this, you know, you're looking around for your enemy targets and they're nowhere to be found. I suspect maybe that could be the case here. Uh, oh, I've run into something, what is it? It's an enemy contact of some description. On sonar lost contact. Last bearing two eight six contact faded. Okay, so come on my come my decoys just to uh, be ready in case it is this carrier group, which I hope it is. Come left to two eight three helm I make turns for two knots maneuvering I. Okay, nice and slow on the. Uh, Speed there to improve my detection ability. Knots maneuvering, making turns for two knots. Pumps go. Con sonar, new contact bearing two nine seven, designated Sierra one. Okay, there's enemy contact, but what is that signature? I don't think that signature is what I'm looking for. I'll try it, but I don't think it is. No, it's none of those. Okay. I've got a sneaking suspicion that uh, signature profile could be either a submarine or a biologic. November submarine. Okay. Con sonar Sierra One is classified yep. as submerged submarine. Now that confirms it. So I found an enemy sub. Raise the radar mast. I'm doing the radar mast as well, just in case uh, the submarine is literally just uh, escorting Con sonar this carrier contact. group. Sierra One, last lower the radar mast. Yeah, nothing on the radar, so uh, no surface vessels up there. Fantastic. So I'm going to have to get myself down and deal with this November class submarine. Make depth one zero 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 feet dive by. I was doing some research a few weeks ago about the November submarine, and one thing I found interesting: in this game, it is rated as having a top speed of 26 knots, which, coincidentally, if you're using the sonar, uh, contact on Sierra Mark 37 one, torpedoes. Three. Zero, on the five. 1964 campaign, that is just Con about Star fast enough contact. Sierra, to one, uh, to catch up to and three, to strike zero, the November. However, if I recall correctly, the the actual top speed of a November was 30 or 32 knots, which is faster than is depicted in this game. So at some point, actually, it would be good if I could go into the uh, into the files in the background and maybe see if I can amend that and uh, give it the correct speed. Just to make it more of a challenge. Con sonar Sierra two 
is classified as submerged submarine. Come left to one eight two helm I. Oh, I've got to. I've got to lower the bash go there. Better take that down. Don't want to pick up speed and damage my mast. Come left to one six two helm I. Okay, well that sub appears to be nice and close. So pretty much as soon as I launch my torpedo, I'm, I'll am i be able to go active with it and I should take him out nice and quickly. There we go. Torpedo away. Yep, it's close. Go active and you should find it. And also, because I'm down at a thousand feet, I believe I'm well out of range of being found by his set 65 torpedoes. In fact, if anything, if actually, if he were to launch at me now from his position, the torpedo he shot would probably go back around and find him instead of me. Okay, I better get my wire guided torpedo in the control. And there we go, nice easy kill. Done. Last bearing, zero, seven, nine, contact breaking up. Come right to three, zero, two, helm I. Okay, a bit of time compression, I just speed things up. Crack on, we're trying to find this uh, carrier. Come right to three, zero, zero, helm I. Active then, just in case there's any other targets around anywhere. Don't think there will be. Can be one. Oh no, there is one around. Ah, yes, there we go. There's one. Probably another November or something similar. Classify him up, see what he is. Can you go the right way, my heart? Come on, Come on. Seven. where are you? Con sonar Sierra three is classified as submerged submarine. Con fire control weapon acquired. Okay. Contact is a Victor. Okay. Not sure if that's a Victor in front of me though, but we'll see. Con sonar, noisemaker bearing two eight nine. Con 
Con, fire control, weapon acquired. If that's a victor, then the other one must have been more victor as well. Anyway, next way. Target. Okay, and this sub. Oh no, hold on a minute. That could actually be a troll on the surface, maybe. Yeah. I think that could be a trawler. I'm just checking. Oh no, no. There is definitely another, another sub out there pinging me, though. Unless CR4 is a trawler and then. In the general vicinity of the trawler Con is Sierra four is, is another sub here because that's a trawler definitely. Yep. Mm -hmm. So somewhere in the vicinity of that trawler is another sub. Right. Okay. Yep. Torpedo launch over there. That is the downside of the skipjack. These Aye, sensors are not that good uh, on detecting my enemy. So. Even when they're using active. Con, fire control, weapon con, nope, no, no, moving away from the trawler. Sierra, one, bearing, three, two, six. Oh, well, that's, there we, there we go. That is a downside of the Mark 48s. They have a great detection range at 3,000 yards, but if you've got a, a friendly or civilian in the way, it can be a bit of a pain. Come on. Con, Come to me. Sonar, Come maker, on. Bearing, three, three, three. We can do this. Let's have it. Come on. Con, fire control. Weapon acquired. Con, fire control. Weapon acquired. They're in there somewhere. And that's a November. The previous two submarines weren't, but that one is. Goes in. Con sonar, noise maker, bearing three, three, and there seven. we go, he's gone. Fantastic. Now, is that all my actual enemies on this map, or is there, is there one or two more? As always, weapons nearby. Alright, let's get away from those. Con, torpedo room, tube four ready. First of all, down, two victors, one in November. Yes, excellent results, but it was my target, I know that. I mean, looking at the map here, where is this uh, carrier battle group? Another submarine there. Ah, oh, sorry, why not? Yep, go on. I'll take him out as well. I've got nothing better to do with my time. <laughs> After all, as we say in the subsum community, Come left be more aggressive. Zero. Just have a quick check in case uh, that someone is screening any uh, surface units, but I don't think it is. Raise the radar mast. I think the game has probably glitched at this point and just, you know, Lower the radar mast. not giving me the uh, carrier group which I was expecting. 
Otherwise, by now, surely I would, I would have failed the mission for not finding it. Make depth four zero zero feet dive by. All right. Okay, take the depth down a bit. Four hundred feet should Make be good enough. Four, two knots, maneuvering eye. Yeah, a bit of time compression there, just speed things up. Con maneuvering, making turns for two knots. As always, nice and slow. Con sonar, new contact bearing zero nine seven, designated Sierra one. Con sonar, switching to active search. Come right to zero nine five. Helm I. Con sonar, switching to passive search. Okay, so there's a target over there, but I'm not getting a a good enough uh, detection right to, to classify zero, him. Nine two. Helm I. Con. Con sonar, new contact bearing, zero, five, four, designated Sierra, two. Okay, another contact, so possibly two enemy subs here. Okay, what's this one likely to be? Looks for Victor. Con sonar, Sierra, two, oh, is classified Victor or November. Submerged. Summary. At the moment, I'm going with November. Which we felt pretty Complex easy subs to take down in this game, anyway, so uh, seven, seven, not Helm too I. much of a concern. Con Helm, steady course. I mean, November's can be a bit tricky if you're playing the 60, uh, the 68 campaign, and your, you, you know, you've got your Mark 37 torpedoes, which are quite kind of slow. But Skipjack 1984 with a Mark 48, he's got no chance. Look at Sex 65s. Chance of them finding me are quite remote, really. Shoot two four, I sir. Sierra 2. There we go, send it active straight away. I'll Make go find him. Increase my speed, eye. one five knots. It's fast enough to get me out of the way whilst maintaining the wire. Con maneuvering, making turns for one five knots. Okay, that's the end of him, easy as that. Okay, still enemy nearby then, right, so that is not end. switching to active search. Okay, that's Come right to one zero four. Helm I Rig ship for ultra quiet. Make turns for two knots. Maneuvering eye. Con fire control, we've lost the wire. Con sonar, launch transient from Sierra 2. Con sonar, Sierra 1 is classified as submerged submarine. Okay, so he's classified. Peter broke the wire, but I will. Make turns for 1, 5. 
Knox, maneuvering eye. But after all, these Mark 48s are pretty good anyway, so. Oh, I'm gonna have to get out of dodge here. But to be fair, I think my torpedo is gonna find him anyway. Okay. Change me depth. Drop a counter measure. Fire control, weapon uh, maximum speed. Con, sonar, torpedo in the water, torpedo in the water, bearing one, six, two. Con, sonar, noisemaker, bearing one, four, five. And just for reference as well, in case anybody is wondering, I only ever play this game on elite difficulty. Con, so that makes my uh, submarine more vulnerable to damage. Um, so my hull strength is 0 0.8 instead of instead of one. So 80% of actual uh, usual strength in the game, and also the enemy uh, weapons are uh, a little bit more effective if they detonate, not just in contact with my sub, but very close by as well. So uh, yeah, I've given myself the biggest possible ch challenge I can on this on this era. Zero feet die by. Con, knuckle formed. There we go. I mean, sometimes I do get unlucky. I do take damage occasionally. Um, but I've been playing the game long enough now that more often than not, I can win. That said, this is my first ever time trying to do an entire uh, 1984 campaign with the Skipjack. But I'm quite enjoying it, to be honest. I mean, you know, the Skipjack is kind of limited and basic. But it goes to show, if you use your decoys wisely and you take advantage of the boat's um, maneuverability, it's very maneuverable by the way, and its speed, you can get out of trouble more often than not. The only real downside is you can only wire guide one torpedo at a time and its um, detection ability. That there is real big flaws to be fair. But it's, not a, it's not a bad submarine to use. Oh there we go. My torpedo I fired in the direction of the, uh, the enemy sub has found it and destroyed it. Now it's just a case of avoiding God, uh, this torpedo, and hopefully that will be me in the clear. Make depth four zero zero feet. Die by. Con knuckle formed. Con knuckle formed. Con, knuckle formed. Passing 400 feet. Con, knuckle formed. Yep, yeah, plenty of knuckles as well. Um, as I say, knuckles are often a lifesaver and they do save you dropping your own countermeasures. Ship for ultra quiet. Uh, 
okay so that is uh, done but I'm, I'm quite annoyed though because I'm you know trying to find this carry group is what I really really want a massive juicy target and I do believe the game has probably just glitched and uh, yeah it's not going to present it to me so and I've took out pretty much everything there's been and nothing's come for me Okay, there's that ship icon on the Barents Sea, but it's supposed to be entering the Norwegian Sea. Ah, what the hell. Take out another submarine or two, might as well. I've got anything better to do. Sonar Sierra One is classified as merchant. Okay, so merchant is it? Hmm. Yeah, it could be a merchant or a, or a trawler, more than likely. Yep, surface vessel. Anyway, in either case. Okay, we're saying uh, launch transit from Sierra One, except it's not from Sierra One because so Sierra One is a surface vessel and certainly not an enemy. Either. So there's another contact which is uh, that'll be it. Yep, there he is. I'll say it's a bit of a challenge, like say with the sensors on this uh, skipjack. <laughs> They're not exactly the best in the world, so uh, we do what we can. There we go. Now you're a kilo, are you? Sonar Sierra 2 is classified as submerged oh, submarine. In the thermocline there. Look at him. What a sneaky sod. We're going to deal with that. Con sonar. Switching the pass. Come right to 220. Helm I. Come down at 1,000 feet. So anything he launches at me is going to have to come down a long, long way before it has a chance to get close to me. Sonar, noisemaker bearing one nine four. Con fire control weapon acquired. Ah, it's not a kilo. I think that's a tango, actually, so I've misclassified that. Some of these classifications are quite close together on the uh, on the scale there when you're looking for them. Tango. Sonar, That's Sierra better. Two 
is classified as submerged submarine. Where possible as well, it's always best to try and get an, a, an accurate uh, uh, sonar, classification on your target. Two, Reason zero, being, if, you, if your classification is slightly off, it can throw off your firing solution. Gives you incorrect values and things, so uh, if possible, it's always best to get a, a correct solution. Oh, sorry, a correct classification. Because the classification affects the solution. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. Con sonar lost contact. Sierra two. Last bearing two. Zero three. Contact breaking up. Okay, what's the end of him? Anything else I need to worry about? Okay, so weapons nearby, so that should be my enemies all gone. But again, what's this now? Three or four missions now without a uh, sign of my um, carrier group? Con, and no mission fail two, either? Four ready. Come on, where are you? This is taking the Michael. Yeah, this game is definitely glitched to this point. Because I'm still looking for this carrier task force and there's no sign anywhere. And there's no mission fail either, so it, it's, that's not the problem. I know it said earlier when it's supposed to be heading towards the North Atlantic, which would have been a fail by now. Well, uh, what the hell, let's just, uh, <laughs> let's come over to North Atlantic just to see. Let's give it a try. Got for West Germany, okay. So West Germany is under greater threats. Okay, new mission, Spetsnaz Commandos. No sign of a fail, so it did glitch. I do love this game, but I'm, I'm finding more and more these days. I am picking up now on uh, the glitches a lot more often. At least that there coming down the uh, coming down Norway should be my actual target that I do want now. Now that my mission parameters have changed. This is quite Helm shallow. Two, zero, four, three. Helm, I. I do believe actually I just spotted a torpedo launch, so Make I'm already four, under five, threat. Zero, okay. Turns. Make turns for two, nine, and there's definitely eye. could be two enemies here. Okay, so that one's a Foxtrot. What's this? Con maneuvering, uh, making okay. turns for two knots. So what's this one then? And it uh, might be a merchant, maybe. So it's not a submarine, not a biologic. Okay, so two is a trawler. Or merchant, yeah. Trawler, merchant, same thing. Con sonar lost contact. Sierra two. Last bearing two. Three. 
six. Contact faded. Con sonar. Con helm. Steady course. Okay, so two merchants, which I don't need to worry about, and just one foxtrot, which will be the uh, Spetsnaz commandos, because they always seem to travel in old-fashioned diesel boats. Better watch my depth there, I don't want to get too close to the seafloor. Shoot two one, aye sir. Con sonar, launch transient from Sierra one. I'm deliberately staying quiet here just in case there is another enemy sub around. Sometimes these uh, little Spetsnaz boats do have uh, a more formidable, more formidable escort. Come left to three, one, one. Make turns for one, five knots. Maneuvering eye. So look at this, this should be over pretty soon, and then that is my uh, new mission completed instead of the one I was hoping for. <laughs> ah, down cold water's glitches. The game is pretty good, but the glitches pretty poor sometimes. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. There he is. Okay, and that's the end of him, so... Okay, weapons nearby again, as always. Let's get away from that. Oh, yeah, there's the enemy torpedo. Right. Con, torpedo room, tube one ready. And there we go, mission complete. 
Just a pity it wasn't the mission I was hoping for all along, but uh, that, that is what it is. Excellent performance, etc. Well, Red Sub sunk. Yada yada, we were in the mission. Well, thank you for watching, guys. It is appreciated. Please give me a like and subscribe if you enjoy my content. Thank you very much.